What up, dog? We're back now with more dogs. The new movie getting rave reviews about two amateurs making millions as arms dealers. ABC's Nick Watts sat down with one of the film's stars, Bradley Cooper, and director Todd Phillips. Give me some of that. This is a tall but true tale of two 20-something stoners from Miami embroiled in a $300 million arms deal selling ammo to the Pentagon to arm Afghanistan. We're gun runners. You're putting these guys that I can relate to into that very outlandish circumstance, which is real and grounded and actually happened. If I was in their position, I'd probably have tried it. Oh, me it. too, for sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, for sure. You wouldn't have gotten caught. No, I would, I'd still be doing it. <laughs> he's, he, may, he may be doing it. <laughs> I, I'd still be That's doing it. That's why it's so good, because he knows what he's doing. <laughs> Don't worry, I have to go first, I'm American. It's all about Jonah Hill's swagger, Miles Teller's doe eyes, and Bradley Cooper. Mm -hmm. Just Bradley Cooper. Got it. I like this idea also, from a character standpoint, just to ground it a little bit, was that, that he's really been battered. I mean, like, the choice of that lifestyle has worn its welcome on his body. Like, my eyes get red normally, and so my eyes are like bloodshot. You're a good looking man, and you're not afraid to look slightly weird in a film. You know, I mean, thank you. Uh, but Bradley's <laughs> yeah. biggest problem is admitting that he's even good looking. So he doesn't even right. see him the way you and I see him. Right. So you have no doesn't problem he? dressing it down. Cooper, people's sexiest man alive 2011, plays a damaged, dastardly like arms dealer. Yeah, I'm not a bad man, but sometimes I think, what would a bad man do? It's a great line. Yeah. And he really believes that. Cooper also produces, partnered with Hangover director Todd Phillips. It's ultimately still about guys making bad decisions, which all my movies seem to be about. This is our first uh, product, really. Yeah. And you're yeah. still friends? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there haven't really been a ton of movies made about the obscene amount of money that a very small group of people make off of war. Explains. This is the job to do business with the people the U.S. government can't do business with directly. And entertains. For Good Morning America, Nick Watt, ABC News, Los Angeles. All right, thanks to Nick. War Dogs hits theaters tomorrow.